Good morning, guys. I wanted to show you some things that I've been making. As you guys know that the um, beads, metals, and wires has been canceled. It will come back maybe after after the new year. So let me show you what I was in process of doing. Okay, first we have a tassel. Let me see if I can move my camera up a little bit so you guys can see better. Sorry. So we have a tassel. It's got a um, little... Um, Claw keychain thing. So I've used some bunch of ribbon and some my lash trim. So I just made that today actually. So then I did some charms, beaded charms, tassels, that's what I meant to say. Okay, with some charms on it. So it's got a little joy on it. So I made this one. I hope you guys can see it well. It looks like it's kind of blurry. So I made that one. And then I made this. You can put them on your like your journals or your planners that you guys love to do. You know, things like that. So I made these. These are all in beads. I got these beads from... Tina Massey over at Happy Mail. These are my here. So I got that. Did that one because I love my purple. Then I did, oops, then I did these. Similar, just different beads. There you go, much better. Now it's focus. And I just put it on the charm so it, I mean, a chain so it'll dang off your, you know, your journal. Then, of course, I did a smaller one, like the first one, kind of. Okay. They all have a little clasp on it. Then I did some paper, uh, paper tassels or some beads. Sorry, just trying to do something different because I have the camera in front of me instead of above me. So then I made that. I haven't put it on a, a... Oops, sorry. I haven't put it on a chain yet. But you know me. I have to do my steampunk. Come on, focus. Then I did this one. Paper tassel. So put my hand in first. Focus. There you go. So did that one. Just the back. Okay. Then I did this one. This one has a chain on it. Whoops. Sorry, guys. And then I did this um, stick pin. And the same thing, this one. Whoops. A lot of people were asking, what do you do with the stick pins? I'm going to show you. I had, someone had made me, we had did a swap on a mini album. And this was, my, this is the one she sent me. Wish I would have video of my stuff. I would never video all my stuff. You guys don't, you guys don't know what I can make. <laughs> so let me bring it up just a little bit. You see how you decorate the front of the, the album? You can stick it inside like this. This is just a pure little stick pin that she just... Stuck in it to make embellishment. You know, it's like all it is is embellishment. So that's what we do over at Mass Mini Album Swaps. So that's what we do. So then I did this. I'm not too happy with it, but I tried. Oops. 
paper clip, I put beads around it, and it has a little gem in the back, a little flower bead on top. So I tried, tried something different. Didn't like it, but it'll be used. So then I made these little icicles that you can either put on your tree or you can, um, of course, put it on your pocket letters, flip books, even your journals. I thought that was cool. I made a little, you know, circle so you can just dangle it on it. You can even add a little chain to it or a clasp. Right now, I don't know what I'm going to use it for. I might put them on a pocket letter. I'm doing a swap, so I might... I mean, not, I'm doing a challenge, so I might just put those in there for um, uh, an ornament. So this has the flower. And all this is done, this has the wire running all the way down here, down to the bottom, and I twist it at the bottom. So, and that's the last one here. Oh, and I want to show you something else I made. I just stuck it up out of the way because I was cleaning my room yesterday because I was looking for my Tim Holtz, Tim Holtz, um, what do you call it, ruler, and I can't find it. I think I might have tossed it in the garbage by accident. Okay, so I made this one. I will definitely have this, like, hanging off of a pocket letter or something because I have the, the, the rope here. I got a little octopus at the bottom. So, and then I got, of course, I have my clock and the wooden gear that I got from Jen over, oops, sorry, got it from Jen over at Scrap and Jen. Of course, I put a feather in it, black, and a metal key. So that was another one I made. And I also tried another thing. I don't like it. I really wasn't going to show it, but I might as well just show it since I'm here. I don't like it. I just use it in my window. Tell me what you guys think. It's, uh, I guess, a tree of life. Am I in the light? Yes, I am. It's my tree of life. I tried. It's my first time trying. I made the, the, round, the ring out of metal wire. And then I took smaller wire and made the little trunk around and made the branches. These beads are also from Tina Massey. Thank you. So, and then I hooked it on a chain. And I hang it up in my window. And one more thing, since I'm on the roll, let me pick you up and take you to my window a little bit. I'll cover it so you don't have... Nausea, remember my CD charm? I mean, my CD um thing I made? Well, here's what I did to it. I did the CD up here. Oops. I made the moon. Okay. Put some stickers, and I did some alcohol ink on it, and put some glitter on it. So it, I guess it would shine a little bit if I let the, wind, mirror, the light in. Now this doesn't go on it, so see how it is right there? So keep this out of the way. So then have some beads on it. It's my first try. I, I mean, I don't, it's okay. So there's my uh, feathers. These are all out of CDs. So that's my... wish I showed you it better, but of course... Think of this while you're on the, there you go. So that's my wind charm. Okay, so that's what I've been up to besides doing other things. Hey, Tina Massey, look, I got four of them. So let me cover you up again, bring you back. Okay, so tell me what you guys think. Guys, until my next video. Bye.